Former U.S. officials concerned Trump being played by Putin. Former U.S. intelligence officials, recently criticized by President Donald Trump as political hacks, voice concern Sunday that Russian leader Vladimir Putin sees Trump as ripe to be played by foreign powers appealing to his ego. Trump administration officials countered by maintaining that the president's warmer relations toward Russia are essential in U.S. efforts to quash North Korean nuclear ambitions. It has either naively, ignorance or fear. Former CIA director John Brennan told CNN's State of the Union of Trump a statement that Putin feels insulted by questions about Russian interference in the 2016 election. And I think it demonstrates to Mr. Putin that Donald Trump can be played by foreign leaders who are going to appeal to his ego and to try to play upon his insecurities, Brennan said. Trump is nearing the end of a 13-day trip to Asia during which he and Putin met on the sidelines of an economic conference in Vietnam. The face-to-face -face meeting generated new criticism of Trump's reluctance to rebuff Putin, though building an alliance against Pyongyang has been an overall mission of the trip. Brennan and former director of national intelligence James Clapper spoke on the heels of remarks by Trump that he believes Putin believes it when the Russian president says Moscow didn't medal in the U.S. election. Trump said in Hanoi, Vietnam, as to whether I believe it or not, I am with our agencies. And, frankly, Russia and China in particular can help us with the North Korea problem, which is one of our truly great problems. Stateside, his top aides echoed the sentiment that Trump is focused on a broader strategy agenda with Russia. President Trump is not getting played by anybody, Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin said on CNN. President Trump was focused on some very important issues, which are North Korea and Syria. And those are areas that we need to work together with Russia. On NBC News Meet the Press. White House Legislative Affairs Director Mark Short said Trump does believe the intelligence community's conclusion that the Kremlin meddled. But Short clarified, he believes that after a year of investigations and spending of tens of millions of taxpayer dollars, there is zero evidence of any ballot being impacted by Russian interference. Short continued, and nuclear weapons in North Korea is a greater threat than Russia buying Facebook ads in America. Clapper said he does not believe Moscow will work for U.S. interests. The Russians do not harbor good intentions toward the United States, and there shouldn't be any illusions or any ambiguity about that, he told CNN. And our president, the president fosters that ambiguity.